John Krasinski has delved into an entirely new genre and style from his previous work with the horror film A Quiet Place. The film is pretty unique in that there's this looming tension at play throughout, but Krasinski does take time for more tender moments within the family's life, and it appears he even snuck in a reference to The Office that you probably missed. There will be some spoilers for A Quiet Place in this video if you haven't seen it yet and want to remain in the dark, consider yourself warned. From the very start of A Quiet Place, the film puts you in a tense state of mind with the Abbott family silently gathering supplies in an abandoned storefront and very cautiously deciding what's worth bringing and what's too dangerous. When young Bo Abbott makes the first loud noise of the film about five to 10 minutes in and is quickly attacked by the film's mysterious creatures, we become well aware of just how important remaining as quiet as possible is. This emotional setup of the film's stakes is what makes the few tender moments in the family's life all the more meaningful. This includes a scene where Emily Blunt's character Evelyn meets her husband Lee in his workshop and they begin a slow dance while sharing an iPod. This is the scene that bears a striking resemblance to a scene from The Office where Pam and Jim share a pair of headphones and is a similarly tender moment between the two. The big difference here being that the only monster involved is Pam's crappy fiance getting in the way of this turning into something more. Dang it, Roy. This, of course, doesn't change anything about how we respond to A Quiet Place. The headphone scene is a great character moment between Lee and Evelyn, and of course, emotionally works without knowing the office reference. Now I just need to go back for round two on A Quiet Place and look for a sign that reads Shrew Farms. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe to Cinema Blend for more on all the entertainment you care about.